Welcome to the heart of America's Corn Belt, where endless gold and cornfields stretch across Iowa, Illinois, Nebraska, and beyond, painting a stunning portrait of global agricultural might. Today, we're embarking on an awe-inspiring journey to explore the incredible world of corn. From tiny seeds sown in fertile soil, nurtured by farmers' hands, to cutting-edge factories transforming it into food, fuel, and life-changing innovations. Join Radiant Farming to discover why corn, or maize, isn't just a crop, it's a symbol of innovation, sustainability, and nourishment for humanity. Corn is a titan of global agriculture. In 2024, our planet produced over 1.2 billion tons of corn, with the United States leading the charge at 350 million tons, more than 30% of the world's supply. The Corn Belt, spanning 96 million acres from Iowa to Indiana, is the powerhouse behind this dominance. This isn't just farmland, it's the heartbeat of a multi-hundred billion dollar industry that supplies food, animal feed, biofuels, and raw materials for countless products. Only 10% of corn becomes food for humans. The rest transforms into livestock feed, ethanol for vehicles, or industrial goods like bioplastics. Last year, the U.S. exported 70 million tons of corn, with 31% heading to China, generating billions in revenue. From tortillas on Mexican tables to popcorn in movie theaters, corn is truly the goal of modern farming. The journey of corn begins with its first steps, planting. In late April, when the soil warms to 50 degrees Fahrenheit, Farmers across the Corn Belt kick off the season. The land is prepared with care, like a canvas before a masterpiece. Farmers test soil pH, ideally between 6.0 and 7.5, to ensure the best growing conditions for corn. They use machines or safe herbicides to clear weeds then plow and till the soil, creating a loose, root-friendly environment. Organic compost, manure, or MPK fertilizers are applied to enrich the soil with nutrients. State-of-the-art planters, guided by GPS, are the pride of American agriculture. Moving at 10 miles per hour, they sow 28,000 to 34,000 seeds per acre, placing them 1.5 to 2 inches deep in 30-inch rows, ensuring optimal space for growth. Of the 316,000 corn farms in the U.S., 95% are family-owned, where generations of farmers blend time-honored wisdom with advanced technology. Once planted, corn needs nurturing like a growing child. As a tropical crop, corn thrives in temperatures between 61 degrees Fahrenheit and 95 degrees Fahrenheit and requires 20 to 30 inches of water per season. In arid regions, center pivot irrigation systems are a lifeline. These massive machines, stretching up to 2,640 feet, can water 1,300 acres in a single operation using automated engines and wheels to move. Sprinklers are fine-tuned to deliver 1.5 to 2.5 inches of water weekly, especially critical during flowering and cob formation. Fertilization is key to yields. 
Each acre needs 150 to 200 pounds of nitrogen, 50 to 70 pounds of phosphorus, and 40 to 60 pounds of potassium applied at critical stages, three to five leaves, tasseling, and post-pollination. Modern fertilizer applicators, equipped with GPS and nutrient sensors, distribute these precisely, boosting yields by 20% while minimizing environmental impact. Farmers also use tablets and apps to monitor crop health, turning fields into open-air laboratories. But corn doesn't grow without challenges. Pests and diseases are formidable foes. Corn borers, cutworms, flea beetles, and Stewart's bacterial will can devastate crops if unchecked. Farmers employ integrated pest management to protect their fields. Genetically modified GMO corn, grown on 90% of U.S. corn acres, resists pests, reducing the need for chemical pesticides. Crop rotation, alternating corn with soybeans, for example, disrupts pest breeding cycles. Natural predators like ladybugs are released to eat aphids and larvae. Drones buzz over fields, capturing thermal images to spot issues early, while small planes spray probiotics to keep plants healthy without harsh chemicals. Farmers regularly walk their rows, inspecting leaves and cobs, jotting notes in notebooks or on tablets. Over 115 days, from seed to maturity, this meticulous care transforms fields into green miracles. Harvest season, from August to October, is the climax of the corn cycle. When leaves turn yellow and husks brown, kernels reach 15 to 20 percent moisture the perfect time to harvest. Combined harvesters, powered by 400 horsepower engines, dominate the fields. They sweep through rows, cutting stalks, shelling kernels, and storing up to 350 bushels in onboard tanks, harvesting 15 acres daily with minimal loss. In 2024, Stone Ridge Dairy in Illinois harvested 54,100 tons of corn silage in just seven days. Using 75,700 liters of fuel and a fleet of 13 semi-trucks hauling 1,850 to loads, each averaging 26.5 metric tons. But not all corn is machine harvested. Sweet corn, prized for its natural sweetness, is often hand-picked in states like Florida, where 37,000 acres yielded 13.6 tons. Workers check each cob, selecting tender, juicy ones to ensure top market quality. Hand harvesting sweet corn is an art form. Workers move through rows, gently snapping cobs from stalks, placing them in baskets or onto conveyors. Post-harvest, the corn is immediately cooled to 30 to degrees Fahrenheit using hydrocooling, preserving its sweetness for two weeks. In smaller farms, like those in Georgia, hand-picking remains common, with teams harvesting one to two acres daily. 
The sight of workers toiling amid golden fields, laughing and sorting cobs, feels like a rural symphony, brimming with life and joy. For silage, heavy-duty machines like the Krona Big X1180 with a 1,156 horsepower engine chop entire corn plants, preparing feed for dairy farms. Trucks tirelessly shuttle corn to storage, where it's packed tightly for fermentation, providing nutrient-rich feed for livestock. After harvest, corn embarks on a new chapter, processing. At facilities near farms, cobs are transported within four hours to maintain freshness. The process starts with cleaning and sorting. Machines remove husks, dirt, and debris, while workers inspect quality, ensuring only the best cobs proceed. Popcorn, an iconic snack, has its own journey. Made from flint corn with 13 to 14 percent moisture, kernels are roasted at 356 to 390 to degrees Fahrenheit in industrial ovens, popping into crispy pieces. A factory can process thousands of pounds per hour. After popping, the popcorn passes through seasoning drums where butter, caramel, cheese or chocolate is misted evenly using spray technology. It's quickly cooled to maintain crunch, then packaged in vacuum sealed or nitrogen flushed bags to extend shelf life. In 2023, 230 to million Americans consumed 14 billion quarts of popcorn, making it a cultural and economic phenomenon. Scenes of moviegoers munching popcorn or kids giggling over caramel-coated bags highlight its global appeal. Canned corn production is a technological marvel. Machines shell 7,000 kernels per hour then blanch them in hot water or steam for two to five minutes to deactivate enzymes, preserving flavor and color. Kernels are rapidly cooled with cold water or air, then packed into cans with brine or syrup. High-speed road refilling systems handle 300 to 450 cans per minute sealing them tightly and sterilizing at 240 degrees Fahrenheit for 20 to 40 minutes. A single plant can produce 40 to million cans annually, delivering sweet corn to tables worldwide.
Corn's versatility is staggering. Sweet corn graces dinner tables, thin corn nourishes livestock, and flint corn becomes popcorn or tortillas, the soul of Mexican cuisine. Cornmeal, milled from dried kernels, powers gluten-free baking, southern cornbread, and dishes like polenta. Corn all, extracted at 2.5 pounds per liter, offers healthy fats with a high smoke point, ideal for frying. Ethanol, a renewable fuel, reduces greenhouse gas emissions, powering cars and machinery. Corn silage, fermented from whole plants, is a staple for dairy farms, with operations like Stone Ridge producing 49,078 metric tons in 2024. Even husks and cobs are repurposed, ground into organic fertilizer, ensuring zero waste. Bioplastics from corn starch, like cups and bags that decompose in 180 days, are replacing traditional plastics, helping save the planet. The corn industry is an economic juggernaut. In 2024, corn exports generated billions, employing thousands of farmers, factory workers, and scientists. China, Mexico, and Japan are top markets, with China taking 31% of U.S. exports. Family farms, leveraging tools like IOT sensors, big data, and drones achieve unprecedented efficiency. About 90% of U.S. corn is GMO, boosting yields and pest resistance, though it sparks debates over environment and health. The industry faces challenges. Climate change brings droughts and floods, rising fertilizer and fuel costs strain budgets, and consumers demand sustainable practices. Yet farmers persevere, adopting regenerative techniques like cover cropping to retain soil moisture and reducing chemical reliance. The journey of corn is a testament to human ingenuity and nature's generosity. From a tiny seed planted by a family farmer to a can of corn on your supermarket shelf, an ethanol tank fueling clean energy, or a biodegradable cup, corn shapes our lives in countless ways. The goal and fields of the Corn Belt are more than farmland. They're the pulse of a global industry, a symbol of resilience, innovation, and sustainability. From the sweat of farmers in the fields to the hum of bustling factories, Corn's story is an epic of transformation and impact. As the sun sets over Iowa's fields, we bid farewell, carrying hope for a future where corn continues to shine like gold. Thank you for joining Radiant Farming on this exploration of corn's golden legacy. Share your thoughts in the comments below and join Radiant Farming by liking, sharing, and subscribing to explore more incredible stories of agriculture. Until our next adventure in the world of farming, see you next time.